My goal as a scientist is to understand cancer and to understand what causes cancer. And cancer is a complex disease, which means it's caused by the mixture of factors, lifestyle factors, environmental factors, and genetic factors. We have this in the and we know a lot about some of these factors, like for example smoking. But what we don't know is how all these factors play together and how they interact and how it gives rise to the cancer. And if we be able to understand this, we also be able to prevent cancer. I'm an epidemiologist, which means I collect and analyze uh, health data with the aim to find patterns and causes of cancer. And for my research, what is important is a high quality um, epidemiological data. So I rely a lot on people participating and volunteers participating in research. And during the research, scientists like me, they ask questions. Uh, for example, what is your lifestyle choices? Do you exercise? Do you not? We also collect uh, biological material, like for example, um, blood samples. Is that wings? And the next step, I also combine this collected material from volunteers, from healthy people and from the diseased people with the registry data. So I'm also relying on the high quality registry data, like for example, death registry or cancer registry. And then what I do, I apply state of the art statistical methods and machine learning algorithms to combine all this wealth of data and to find um, patterns in this data and to find some causal association between multiple factors. Here at SDU we have one of the largest and oldest collection of twins, the Danish Twin Registry. And over the more than 100 years it collected information on more than 170,000 twins, including also biological material for some of them. And non-identical twins are like siblings. They share bringing and earlier lifestyle exposure. On top of it, identical twins also share their genetics. And by comparing the rate of cancer between identical and non-identical twins, I can study the role of genetic and environmental factors and interaction between them and what causes cancer. Do you think it makes sense to apply for all cancers, for example? Well, SDU and DS is uh, very important for my research. Being close to the Danish Twin Registry and to the other health registries is crucial for my research. And on top of it, DS provides a very safe and nourishing and friendly environment where I can develop my ideas, discuss them with colleagues, with colleagues from different disciplines and grow as a scientist.